Okay, some of my students are looking at using Pi Game as part of their uh, TC101 course, and in particular on a Mac and using Python 3 since that's what we're using. So I, I found this uh, Wiki Macintosh um, page on the pygame.org site, and it's telling us we should probably make sure that our homebrew binaries, it, it assumes we've already installed homebrew, so you could go watch my video about installing homebrew in Python 3. And then it's saying you should really make sure that your homebrew is at the beginning of your path, which it actually is for me. But I'm going to go ahead and edit my .bash profile, which is at the root um, of my home directory. So we want that just to make sure that everything's good. Uh, then actually if we turn close the terminal, I'll give you a little trick here. If you run the export command, it shows a bunch of file environment variables that are in your system. And I'm going to uh, grab path out of that. And we'll see that our path is indeed user local bin. And it's actually user local bin twice, so I should fix that. It's uh, declared at system level on my machine, but it might not have been on yours. So we're, we'll be fine there. And then we want to install, we want to make sure we have the Apple Xcode installed. So let's follow that instruction. It's already installed. Um, so if you didn't have it already installed, it would have asked you for your, your password to allow it to install software as administrative user, and all that would happen. So I've already got that, we're good. Make sure that you have Xquartz installed. So why don't I go there, do that quickly. I'm pretty sure I have Xquartz already installed. Maybe I don't. So let's go download that and we'll install it. I just totally cleaned up my user local directory to do that other dumb video. So if uh, I don't have it installed, I might as well just install it here. So. So there we go, we have uh, Xcorts downloaded, so I'm going to open that package. There we go. We'll go ahead and install that. hidden behind that window. So we'll go through and finish this Xcorts installation. Of course we read all the disclaimers. Right? I've installed this before. Software license agreement. And we agree. And we're going to go ahead and install that. Remember, Mac always asks you for your permission as admin to install stuff. Excellent. Well, finally it finished because that was a lie about less than a minute. So we're good there. Just should be cleaning up. Nice. So I'm going to close that up. And I'm going to close that up. Homebrew is already installed. We should add some packages here. So I'm going to do that. And there we go. So that's done. Um, now we should be able to run pip3. Oops, we already did that. Copy. There we go. And you want to use pip3, not pip. So it's installing it into your Python 3 packages area and not your regular Python that comes with Mac. And that should be it. Um, the manual tells us we need to restart Mac because we applied these export changes and um, you should be good to go. And I'll wrap up the video for now.